Hey, this is Gary Schultz from Cyclone Re. A few years ago, I had a bout with the uh, Acropora eating red bugs. Sure enough, you know, my uh, eyes, uh, you know, my eyesight just isn't good enough. I didn't notice them. I got a magnifying glass and I could see the red bugs and you can see them in these photos right here or these uh, videos right here. You know, I noticed my corals hadn't really been growing much. My corals were, um, you know, had a lot of white areas on them. My, my acros are covered with these things. Certain ones they like and other ones they don't. They love Joe the Coral. They really like Larry Jackson Purple Monster Coral. Uh, they didn't care for the Miyagi tort so much. Uh, but, you know, all of my corals showed signs of stress. And uh, it really came down to it was all about the red bugs. So this is a testimony to uh, dipping your corals uh, every time you... Uh, you get a new coral, dip them, dip them in the bear, uh, you know, use uh, whatever dip you have, but I would just certainly use that uh, bear dip. Here we got the Interceptor Plus here. It's the Chewables. It's a six pack, it says for 50.1 to 100 pound dogs, six weeks of age and older. Um, so for our tank, we have 200 gallons. And uh, to kill the red bugs, we would need uh, well, about half a pill per to do the 200 gallons. So um, we are going to uh, so one one of these will do 400 gallons. They say like 380 to four. So we're going to go ahead and do a half a pill for ours. So this is what it looks like when you pull it out. It's like look at those massive things. But, uh, I mean, I used to give our dog heartworm pills before he passed away. So I guess this is, basically that's what this is for, is for heartworm. So in is, see if I can pronounce it, Milbemycin oxime prezequantil. So there you go. You're doing a fourth of a pill or a half? Half a pill. Let's see what this looks like here. Dry off this surface here. Yeah, it slices pretty nice. Um, so it's like, it's pretty soft, you know? I mean, it is a chewable. So I don't really know how we're going to get that to melt. Wonderful. You know, when I used to give this crap to the dog, he'd be like, Oh, delicious! Powdery, you know, not bad. You can kind of see, you know, that's about. I think that's pretty good. So we'll just. Uh, see there's a lot on the bottom of this cup so we're going to heat it up just heated it up for 50 seconds and it looks like it's stirring pretty well now um looks pretty well mixed actually so i got this from 1-800 pet meds and um 
I ordered this uh, this stuff. You know, you get six pills. I ordered it. Uh, it was like fifty four dollars. I ordered it at eight p.m. at night, and then the next morning, the uh, a lady from one eight hundred Pet Meds called me pretty early, and she said, you know, we called your vet, and I had put down that it was for the dog. Well, they called my vet, and uh, the vet told them the dog's dead. So she says, what do you want me to do? I said, well, just give me a little bit and then call him back. So I called the vet and I told him the situation with the tank and stuff. And they're like, okay, no problem. And um, so then 1-800-PET-MEDS called me back. Probably, you know, probably an hour elapsed between the first time and the second time. And they said, yep, it's all set to go. Uh, you know, we've got it um, all packed up and ready to ship. So it's going out today. I was like, perfect, you know. So, but you do just remember, you know, all those online. They can't even sell it to you anymore from uh, Canada. Um, Australia is not allowed to ship it in the U.S. without your vet's approval. So you just got to call your vet. Tell them the situation with your tank and uh, explain that, you know, you talked to me and I told you how to do it. So you know how much to give it. So, okay. Anyway. So just remember, one pill treats 380 gallons. So you can do the math from there depending on, on uh, how big your tank is. So let's go put it in. same coral that was just covered in red bugs and exactly 24 hours I don't see any I think this tank is clean there's Joe the coral he had a lot of red bugs on him you can see you know a few years later boy our corals look great I've never seen them color up like this since we've had the tank and um, you know the red bugs were causing all this trouble so uh, like our videos subscribe to our channel uh, if you haven't already and uh, thanks for watching we'll see you next time